right, so Jason just found one, but I left my phone in the car. Let me also, while I'm here, grab a flag and a GPS for him. We got here about an hour ago. Um, we haven't been hunting that long, and he's already found one. So let's go over and take a look at what he's found. He says it's a big one. Where is it? Over here? Is it this guy? Yeah. <laughs> One of the biggest things around. Not bad. Nice. So I'm across. I can't tell if I'm broken here or not. So I'm gonna get it. Oh, it looks pretty fresh. I can't tell if it's nature or not. It's just strong. Nice. Yeah. Alright, I brought a flag and a GPS. Thanks. First find of the day. It's pretty, yeah, we haven't been hunting that many, right? About an hour. Yeah, we'll be a late start. They're here. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna find the rest of this guy. So you're gonna do photos and GPS him and then uh, we'll keep looking. Yeah. Alright, cool. <laughs> So here we are with the flip. Let's see how big this thing is. There we are. I think he goes down a ways, I think. Yeah, look at that. There's a weird triangle. Sorry. strand of rocks here. See the rocks here, there's really not much out there. As we look back, there's lines scraped up by the ice. There's moving rocks as it scraped along the lake. And Krista just gave a shout over here. So let's, let's see what's up. pretty light yeah oh yeah that looks pretty good that's a nice rock that's that was a big chondral on the corner no does that even have any chips i don't think so i think it's complete nice ah pretty meteorite i was just sitting there not even yeah i'm not, not even, even sure where it came from now it's over here somewhere uh, we can look back at the video. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, congrats. Yeah. First one of the day for me. Nice. Yeah, I have been too dense, but nice stone so far. Uh, we'll, we'll figure it out. It's right, I think it's right there. All right. Just sitting just like that. <laughs> there we go. All right. All right. Well, a few pictures, GPS, and... Yep. Uh, what else we can find? Look at all these other rocks. Ah.
right, it looks like Jason just found another one. That'll be his second of the day. Let's go and take a look. What you got? Looks like it fell yesterday. I mean, it's in the lake bed. It's old. Ooh, fresh one. Pocket full of magnetic rocks there, but this guy's a lot stronger. All right, where is he? See, he looks, he looks almost silky. Texture fusion crust. See some rust spots on him, and he's pretty. Yeah. Hopefully, a hole all the way around. We'll see. Didn't think he was one because it was so textured. It looks like some of the rocks you find here, but nice. <laughs> That's Not many today. It's pretty hot. But... Three total. Two for you and one for me. Good. All right. But nice rocks. Your last one was nice. This one's nice. It's good. All right. Well, it's 6 p.m. We still have maybe one or two hours. And look at all the rocks. I haven't gone through any rocks. <laughs> well, a lot of rocks to look at. Let's see what he's like under there. Shadow. Oh, he's complete, I think. <sighs> that weird stippled texture. That's fusion crust. That's how you tell it's not a rock like rounded in a river or something like that. The corners aren't really smoother than the, even the concave surfaces. That's something you usually only see on a meteorite. It's been ablated. Uh, all right, well. Uh, bag, tag, and uh, keep hunting, I guess. Uh, pretty rock. for the day. My finds are pretty magnetic and both have pretty rough fusion crusts due to metal grains. My find doesn't have much iron in it. It has a pretty low magnetism and smoother fusion crust. All three finds look pretty different and they're all probably pieces of different meteorites. They all look like ordinary chondrites so we probably didn't find anything too rare today. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you again soon.